Hi everyone, and today I am painting two small uh, seascapes and I have decided to add gouache to my watercolors just to show you a little bit what it's all about. So I decided to go down to our local little beach that's uh, maybe 500 meters from our house and there's a wonderful tidal pool and I was lucky that it was uh, low tide so I was sitting below the tidal pool, did a bit of a sketch and then the first thing I did was add my, uh, my sea and my sky, which was ultramarine blue, a bit of uh, indigo for the top section of the waterline, and then a bit of viridian added to it. And as you can see, I got carried away, and I've done quite a bit already. But here I'm just showing a little bit what the gouache can do to the watercolor. And uh, so I just add white to any of the watercolor colors and this gives a, uh, a great opaque feeling so that you can um, get a bit more of a layering feel or I guess maybe a bit of an acrylic type of feel uh, just uh, gives so much more uh, variety to a watercolor and that you can bring the lights back in so this is definitely not purest watercolor but it works uh, super well and that very nice greeny color was some viridian mixed with uh, ultramarine and then the gouache and the color of the kelp those little uh, brown dots in the sea that's the kelp floating about and that oh, that was uh, some burnt umber with some ultramarine blue and now I'm just adding some shadows to the uh, to the rocks and that was also ultramarine blue but with some viridian added to it I'll put all the colors down the bottom so that you know the colors that um, I used and uh, just a glorious glorious day out in the Sun uh, lots of people going snorkeling and diving but you can see they've got their full wetsuits on so it's the water's pretty cool uh, even at this time of year which is the beginning of summer so this is my end result and from there I went to the tidal pool which was so first I was sitting below the tidal pool but as the tide came up I went up above the tidal pool and I quite liked this lady sitting on the beach but she had initially sat with her bikini top on which was bright yellow and I decided to uh, keep on adding that color to this so this I didn't add any um, gouache to this only a pure watercolor I had my uh, sunglasses on so the colors looked <laughs> a little bit different from what they are in the in the video so much more intense hence the sort of turquoisey colors that I have got over here I felt the figure was maybe a little bit stiff sitting up uh, too straight but um, anyway a lot of fun and I showed her the painting afterwards and uh, she was really chuffed so uh, a wonderful day with a bit of wind coming up but a, a great day in general and um, I added a bit of the jelly roll at the bottom for the white squiggly lines and this is just a panoramic view of the area and far back on the distance on the hill you can see our house so you can imagine we have a really lovely view.